Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue. Your PC needs to be repaired with error code 0xc000225. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and proceed with the fixing steps. So whenever you got that particular error, you need to turn off your PC using the power button and then restart your PC again using the power button. Do the same process, turn off and turn it on again using the power button two to three times until you see a screen diagnosing your PC. I'll go ahead and show you how the screen look like. So this is how the screen will look. Diagnosing your PC, wait for it until it's completed. Now once it is done, you will get this particular error, automatic repair, your PC did not start correctly. Here click on these advanced options. Now here, you need to choose the option troubleshoot. Now click on advanced options and choose command prompt. Now in command prompt, you need to type few commands one by one to rebuild your BCD. First command is boot rack space slash rebuild BCD and then hit the enter key. The operation is completed successfully. If identified windows installation you will get all then you need to choose the option A or type the A letter to proceed and then hit the enter key. Now once BCD is rebuilt, now type the next command which is boot rack space slash fix boot and then hit the enter key. If it is giving you the error, type boot sec t space slash nt60 space sys and then hit the enter key. Now again type the same command boot rack space slash fix boot and then hit the enter key. Now third command is boot rack space slash fix mbr and then hit the enter key again. Now the operation is completed successfully. Now type exit. Now go ahead and choose the option exit and continue to windows 11 and check if the error is still there or not. If you still getting the same error again you need to choose the same steps to diagnosing your PC and reach over this screen which is troubleshoot screen from here again choose advanced options and type or click on the option command prompt over here now in this step we are going to make your partition as active so type commands one by one first disk part and hit the enter key now type list disk and again hit the enter key now your disk will be shown right in front of you type here Select disk 0 which is disk 0 of your system and hit the enter key again. Once disk is selected, now type list partition and then hit the enter key. Now here you need to choose the partition of your C drive. Type here select partition space the letter of your C drive at my end my C drive is partition 3 which is my primary priority partition so I'll type the letter 3 and then hit the enter key to select it once it is selected simply type active and then hit the enter key again now again type exit this will exit the command prompt now close it and again continues to windows 11 and check the error your PC needs to be repaired is fixed out or not. If it is still there, in third step, again you need to open CMD over here and this time type SFC space slash scan now and then hit the enter key. This command will take up to 10 minutes and it will fix any system corrupted files that are present in your system. Now you can see that it has found corrupted files and has repaired them and the change will take place after the next reboot. So go ahead and restart your system. Type exit, restart your system and then try to check if the error code 0xc000225 
zero 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 two two five is still persist or not? Now, if all these resort fail, the only option you are left with is to reinstall Windows and then recover your data safely. So, for that, you need to have a Windows 10 or Windows 11 installation media and give your system using that particular media. I'll go ahead and boot my system using that Windows 11 USB drive that I have attached to my system and I'll show you how you can recover your data if these options doesn't work out for you. Now after giving the boot, click on the next button to proceed installing Windows and click on the install now option to install Windows in your system. Now choose the option I don't have a product key. Now choose the type of windows you would like to install in your system and hit the next button to continue. Accept the terms and conditions and here is the option. You need to choose the option custom over here. Now in your system click on the drive in which you would like to install windows in your system and make sure you do not click on this format option. If you click on this format option it will completely format your C drive but we need the files which are important to us so simply choose the partition and then click on the next button to continue installing windows in your system once window is installed in your system i'll go ahead and switch to the windows so that i can tell you how you can recover your file from your previous installation of windows now after installing fresh windows in your system you need to open this pc and double click to open c drive here you will find a folder with the name windows.old open this particular folder and here choose the folder with the name users here you will find all the users present in your windows 10 or windows 11 i am using the username lotus geek double click to open it and here double click to open the desktop folder so here whatever files are present onto your desktop will be easily available so that you can directly copy these files and paste in your in windows d drive e drive or anywhere you would like to install you would like to save if all these options fail and you do not recover your files the last hope you have is to recover your data using a software with the name easy us i'll share you the complete detailed tutorial on how you can recover your data safely without paying a single penny to anyone link will be given to you in the description of this video simply watch that particular video and get back all your data in your windows pc so these are the best possible ways to fix out your error with your pc need to be repaired with error code 0xc 0000225 if you are new to this channel don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel Thank you so much friends, thank you for watching.